All right, in today's video, we've got the new Ubiquiti U7 Pro Wall Access Point. So we'll unbox that and we'll show you what it looks like. So one thing we do know with the Ubiquiti, they do have uh, nice designs and also they work really well, it's also handy. So take this bad boy out. All right, so once it's out of the box, we've got our access point, got our template for the wall for the screws and to drill a hole for the cabling. We've got our bracket, our sets of screws as well, and our little uh, L shape to uh, take the bracket off. Get that out of the way. Now with the uh, U7 Pro wall, so a couple of things with the U7 Pro wall, it is Wi-Fi 7, so it's a tri-radio, so it's got the 6 gigahertz radio, 2.4, and the 5 as well. Uh, so with this one, it's only got the one port where the in wall has uh, the integrated switch, this one doesn't, so it's a 2.5 gigabit uh, uplink. Uh, it also has the reset button at the top there. So when you flip it over this way, this is how the bracket mounts. So when it's on the wall, uh, you can sit it on the wall like that, so it sits that way, and then this will just slide right on. So I'll flip it like this. So it just slides in and you'll hear it click. Then if you do need to actually uh, take that bracket off, this is where the L shape uh, key comes in. So what you need to do is if you need to take that off, so while it's on the wall, if you need to take it off, uh, you put it in at the top like that, just push down, bracket comes off, it'll just slide right out. Okay, so there's all our bits and pieces. So we've got our screws, our L shape to take it off the bracket, the template. Uh, so if you want to mount it, you can do it a couple of different ways. So you can mount it uh, flat on the wall, and if your cable is coming in from the wall, that's where this section is uh, coming in from the bracket here. So that's where you can drill the hole with the template. So you can uh, put your drill holes in there. So you can line those up, drill your holes, and your cable can come through. If you're going to mount it and the cable comes from the bottom, uh, there is a clip here that comes off. So same thing, you just don't need to drill a hole for this section. You just put your screws in there, and then you have your cable run through the bottom, and then that can come through into the port there. So depending on how you want to mount it, you can do it a couple of different ways. Um, so we're going to get it set up, uh, adopt it into our system, and then see how it goes. Thanks, guys.